Hello everyone, I'm going to be showing you how to remove your backrest at the back of your vehicle. In order to be able to remove your backrest, you'll need to remove your back bench. Uh, you can take a look at my video uh, in the top corner here. And let's uh, get to work. Alright, so there's a couple bolts we will need to take off. So your first bolt is going to be this one right there. We have that one right there, that one right there, and on the other side as well, and right there. So we'll uh, unscrew those bolts right now. So these are going to be... Oh, for some reason this one's super tight and I do see some rust so maybe just because it is a little bit this bolt is rusted it is rusted a bit so it looks like there's some water that's uh, gone in there This one's also feels like it's rusted a bit, so I'm gonna use an impact driver. There you go, that's the last one. Okay, so just playing around a little bit and so I think what you do is you just, it sits on a hanger or acts like a hanger. So you need to pull the whole assembly up and then pull out. So uh, we'll give that a shot here. All right. Yep. There's a. Uh, there's the seat. So there's the back of the seat there, and uh, here is where. It sits on the backrest, and what makes uh, the SE unique is that it has this bar right here, the um, stabilizer bar, I believe. And pretty much it gives um, an extra stability in the vehicle for... Uh, 
All right, so in order to get it back in, there's these three hooks. There's this one right in the middle there, and there's a third one right there. And those hooks, they get placed into this spot right there. The one in the middle is right there. And then the last one's over there. So um, if you want to make this uh, easier on yourself, you could definitely take off the seat belts so that you're not having to play around with the seat. So um, but, uh, let's put this back on for you. All right, let's uh, put it back on. I'm gonna move this seat belt over here. So I got this one, the driver's side in. I also got passenger side in. I do not have the middle one in. So I'm gonna have to put this up. Yeah, it's uh, a little difficult to get this last one in, middle one. All right, attempt number two, I figured it out. So we want to first get uh, the sides, ones on the sides in first. This clip popped out. Slide this one in. Okay, so the two edges are in. So what I did was I came over here, I lifted this up, this side up. Lifted enough so that the middle can be pushing a little bit. Push this in here. Pretty satisfying click.
those ones in. And that's how you uh, put the seat back in. So uh, next, what you would do is you would just bolt, uh, bolt this one, bolt this one right here, the one right there, and the one right, and that one right there. And that's how you take out the back seat. And uh, that's how you reinstall it as well. So hopefully this was helpful. Um, the reason why I'm currently taking this back seat out is because I need to work on my rear suspension. It can only be accessed just like right here. So that's the plan. Thanks for watching.